Hey there! This is Bobby, aka Paginator, and I am here today to do an unboxing. This makes my heart feel very good because I just came from a viewing uh, for a parent of one of my students, and as you can imagine, very emotional and very sad. And I just had a feeling I should stop by the post office on the way home. And there's my owl crate box, so it's here to cheer me up, and I hope that it will give you a smile as well. If you don't know, Alcrate is a subscription box um, that comes monthly and it comes with a newly published young adult book and goodies to go with it. And it is so much fun and there's a theme every month and it's just, I can't even tell you how much fun it is to see one of these in the mail. It's grand. So let's get to it, shall we? Oh, here we go. All right. Hmm. Okay. Oh, let's see if I can get that in frame, actually. In the woods. And there is a deer skull in a cabin. And the theme is Find Me in the Forest. And each month they have, as I mentioned, a different theme. So Find Me in the Forest is the, is the theme for this month. And on the back of this is spoiler information about the item. So I'm not going to read it right now. I'll just kind of carefully tuck this aside here. All right. So we cannot have a subscription box, or almost no subscription boxes come without this. Crinkle crap. It gets everywhere. So you have to be sure to clean it up immediately because if you leave like even a little piece, let's say like right now I'm sitting in my office, if you leave like even a little piece on the floor, it will get on your sock and you will track it all over the house. So little public service announcement there. All right. Okay, we have an item here. This is a candle and it says Cabe's Water Alcrate Exclusive Moss and Mint and this is created by In the Wick of Time. Oh, that's very pretty. It doesn't have a color really. It's it's white, kind of creamy color, but it does smell like moss and mint. I like that a lot. Hmm, might have to burn that because it's really pretty and would be very calming. All right. Okay. Next we have a little coaster. All good things are wild and free. We've got some little mushrooms and a fox. Very fun. Coasters are always very handy and if it can be a bookish coaster then that's even better, right? Okay, this is making me very curious. There's a box in here. I think this is why the Alcrate box is so tall this month. Hmm. The box itself is just pretty, and it says that there's an Alcrate exclusive mug for the month of October. Nice. October is my favorite month, partly because it's my birth month, but also because it is the month that has Halloween, which is my favorite holiday. It's just a good month all around. Okay, so we've got a mug and it's in bubble wrap. So I'm going to take a second to get it out of the bubble wrap so we can actually see it. Okay. All right, so we've got a woodsy. Let's see if we can see all of the things here. We've got, is that Buckbeak in Hagrid's house? Oh my gosh, it is. And there's the pink umbrella. <gasps> this is a Harry Potter mug. Look, and there's a unicorn. And there's Forenzi. And there's the car. This makes me so happy. Any kind of bookish mug would be awesome, but Harry Potter, oh. This makes my heart feel so good on such a sad day. Oh, I'm so happy that my owl crate came today. <sighs> Thank goodness the post office delivers on Saturdays now, because it seems like when I was a child, they did not. All right, so the next thing I see is pin. Every month in Alcrate we have a pin, and this kind of matches the card. It's got the cabin, mysterious cabin, treehouse-ish building there. Very interesting. Oh, and next we have some cute little bookmarks. I love magnetic bookmarks, and these are from the where, where the wild things are. Ah! Max and one of the wild things. That's so cute. Oh, who doesn't love Where the Wild Things Are? That book is awesome. The movie I have mixed emotions about. 
but the book is fantastic. All right, what's next? Ooh, okay. We have an art print. I'm guessing this is gonna be to do with the book that's in the Alcrate box. It's very interesting and beautiful. Hmm. I have two different places that I keep my art prints from subscription boxes. I have a great big cupboard in my classroom, and so if it's related to a book that I think my students will know of or know about, I, I put it up in there. And then if it's um, not, or if it's something really special that I just want to keep at home or, you know, whatever, then I also have another wall here in this office that I put some art prints on. I saw the book and this makes me so happy. I, when I went to Salt Lake recently, I saw this book and I almost picked it up, but something told me, no, not not quite yet. And I'm so glad I did it because now I get the Owl Crate exclusive cover. Yay! Oh, it is Wild Beauty. Anna Marie Mecklemore. 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 Oh, it's so pretty. Let me get it out of the plastic so you can see. This book is gorgeous, and I am not a girly girl by any means. I My comfort is jeans and t-shirts, and I have weird hair and all that stuff, but there, I mean, this book is, you can't help but be interested when you see these gorgeous flowers, and it looks like there's a little fairy creature there. Oh, that's so pretty. Good job to whoever designed this cover. It's fantastic. All right, so as usual, I'll create sends a note from the author, and I'll go ahead and read that to you. This usually gives us some pretty good information about what the book is going to be. Dear Alcrate Reader, I'm so thrilled to be part of this month's Alcrate, and I'm so excited to introduce you to the Nomulvides women. Nomulvides women. For as long as I can remember, I've been utterly enthralled by gardens. Wild Beauty is the book where my obsession with flowers meets my love for stories filled with dangerous magic. Fairy tales have always been my heart as a writer, and what are fairy tales if not stories of that which is both frightening and enchanting? In Wild Beauty you'll meet the Nomulo Vid Vides family, who tend to the beautiful and sometimes murderous gardens of La Pradera, and you'll meet the younger generation, youngest generation, Gloria, Dahlia, Azalea, Estrella, and Kala, who are all queer Latina girls. However much they disagree about how to navigate the enchantments of La Pradera, this is a common language between them. I'm interested already. Let's keep reading. Wild Beauty is a kind of fairy tale. It is also a tribute to the women who make families and hold them together. And it's a love letter to other girls like me. Queer girls, girls of color, and all girls who don't always get to see themselves in their own fairy tales. I hope you enjoy your time in the magical, sometimes treacherous gardens of La Pradera. I hope the Nomio Vides, I still don't know how to say that name, women remind you of those with whom you share a common language, and I hope that when you turn the last page, a little of La Pradera's magic goes with you. Thank you so much for reading. Abrazos y flores. And then she signed it really illegibly, but that's what authors do. Okay. Um, we also have a signed book plate from Anna Maria, and oh, this is so cute. I just realized what I was holding in my hand. This is a seed packet. Oh, for earlier blooms begin sowing indoors a few weeks before the last frost in your area. How fun. So these are forget-me-nots. Oh, man, I am really bad at growing things, but I am definitely going to try. Now, this we're going to fall time, so obviously it's going to have to wait a while before I can plant these, but that makes me really excited. Yay, what a cool idea to send with a book. And, it, of course, it matches perfectly. That is so awesome. Wow. Okay, so now thinking about what we learned about the book as well as seeing the art print that I'm pretty sure goes with the book, I'm very interested to read this. I have so many books sitting around. If you saw my last video where I um, went to Salt Lake City and bought a ridiculous amount of books, you'd know that I have a lot of books to read. I just finished Turtles all the way down this morning, and I've got like tons of books sitting around. Plus, I got an order um, from Book Outlet. It's just books everywhere, but this one's going to go very high on my TBR because it seems so interesting and, and a different spin on fairy tales. Cool. All right, so this is something that, that's pretty new to Alcrate 
and they do this little booklet. And the last one was in the last month's box. I think that was the first one but um, that came with before she ignites. But they do some information. They show you the Alcrate cover versus the regular cover. Okay, so the Alcrate one is the one closer to my hands, if you can't tell. So there's a little bit of a difference in the um, background there. Um, it's got some questions like an interview with the author, a word search, um, information about the candle that came in the Wick of Time, Alcrate's candle. They've got um, an October box photo challenge. I'm not on Instagram. But I could do it on Facebook, maybe. Uh, I don't know. We'll see. Um, I don't know if I have time for a photo challenge. Let's see. And they've got some information about, about November's theme, which brings us to the very last thing, which is the theme card for next month. And here it is. Castles, Courts, and Kingdoms. Hmm. And on the back of this, they always put a sneak peek. So they're going to tell you about an item that might be in there. And it says, in the November box, you'll receive an item from Juniper and Ivy Designs. And it's, it looks like they make wooden bookmarks and wooden keychains and that kind of thing. Just see how pretty those are. Very nice. Cool. Well, that's exciting. But I am more excited about this book that I just got and, and about these items. And the Harry Potter mug, ugh, it's still my heart. I can't even take it. I, I don't know if I even dare drink out of it because it's so cool and I, I wouldn't dare like risk breaking it because I'm clumsy. Anyway, definitely loved all of the items in this box. I'm super excited about the book. Thank you, Alcrate. I'll put a link down below to Alcrate and Crate Joy if you are interested in checking those out. And I hope you all have a wonderful day. Happy reading. Adios.